<laughs> Bam. All right, here you go. This is uh, how, you, how you do the job board. So you will go to wix.com. That's our website editor. You log into Wix. Um, I'll get you the username and password. And you'll click on this Dropbox. I've made uh, websites for tons of companies. But so this one that you'll want to click on is ours, Carolina Career School. You'll click on Manage Site. From there, you'll click on Edit Site. That will bring you into the editor. Once you're in the editor, we're going to go to the job board, but I'll show you how to get there. So you're going to go to Welcome. This drop down right here takes you to all the unique pages. They've all been search engine optimized. They're all awesome, ready to rock and roll. And we're looking for our job board, which is right here. So you click on the job board. That's going to take you to that specific page. Um, these are hyperlinks that'll take you down to the particular jobs. So if we're looking at dental assisting chair side jobs, um, what we want to do is click add. We're going to add some text. We are going to add a paragraph. We'll put this down under dental assisting jobs. And you just drag this over. Let's just drag it over to the line up with the uh, images. You can click in here. We'll make this box however big we want to. Now, each time you make a job, just make a new box like this. Okay. So um, then, what you would do, and you can, well, after you've done this once, it's just follow the template. You can just copy and, and paste it to the next thing. So what you could do is job title job location details uh, no details is probably good um, if you find anything about like contact person or apply things like that I might these are the main things I'd look for when you're building out our job board so um, if you need to take away some spaces it'll automatically add it you just hit enter and so I'm doing a dental assisting chair side job. I got to click into the text area. So let's say very quickly, I just go to Craigslist. Um, let's say I'm looking in Columbia. So I'm going to click on medical and health. Look at this, dental hygienist wanted. Boom. Here is the information that we want to put on there. So basically we're going to take and copy this stuff. Now the font that we use is called Railway. Copying it, Control C, go over to the editor. I'm just going to paste this below for now and then I'll chip it up into to fit this particular what goes where. Um, so instead of having Times New Roman, our, our font is called Railway. So you just highlight it all. You go to Railway, which is right here. Keeps everything consistent. OK, so job title is dental, what was it, hygienist? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How do you spell that? It doesn't look right, does it? Well, H-Y-G-E-N. G-I-S-U. G-I-E-N-T-I-S-T, -E or is it I-S-T? That's how they spelled it. Anyways, we can double check it um, when we're done. Job location. It's Columbia. Is it downtown Winsboro? Is that Columbia? It came up Columbia. Downtown Winsboro. So, yeah, we'll just throw that in there. Um, downtown Winsboro. Okay. Details. Just grab this right here. Okay. So to copy this but make it go away, you hit Command X. 
Now it's copied, and then I can just put it in a new place. I might go back. In fact, I will go back. Yeah, command V. Yeah, Command V pastes it. And I will just highlight these things. Bold them, I mean. Details. Mm -hmm. Just to make it easier to read. Um, contact is right here. Control X. Now, I might, in this case, I'm just going to have it say apply. Probably keep it the same. Yep. And I'm going to create, above that, I'm going to make a requirements. Right here. So I know dental hygienists isn't what we are, and it looks like they would need a license, but we can still create a really awesome job board just to kind of show people. Um, and I'd probably put this under details. So let me just format this a little bit, prepaid. All holidays, paid vacation, Sam's Club membership, hours. Okay, I'm going to just caps this because it looks like this could be its own category. So this is a little level fruit for us, finding the stuff on like Craigslist, etc. Um, and so I don't have all this empty white space. I'm just gonna two nine what did I do? Two nine one eight oh. Okay. So we kinda wanna follow this format with each one, but um let me click save. Once it's saved, it's good. Then we click publish. It's published. Let's click done. There we are. We click preview to see what it looks like. looks like this. Now what I might do is I might create like a line or just something so it's clear these are dental assisting jobs. Um, uh, let me just add a uh, box. No, a strip. hidden behind it. So I'm going to do undo last thing. Let's just underline it right here. Okay. And then let's do add a line. It's right here. So we're at the the text box that we just used. Let me find the bottom of it. It's right there. So it looks right when we do mobile, and we'll just stretch this line out to, to finish that up. So now when we preview it, it'll look like this. Here's our dental assisting jobs. You know, we got the one, or dental, I might change that to say just dental jobs. In fact, I will. And then down here will be medical, admin, you, you know, lump whatever we want in there. The, the idea is to have a lot of jobs. Okay, go ahead. Good afternoon, Carolina Career School. This is Kathy. How can I help you? Um, she's not in right now. May I take a message for her, please? Okay, what I can do is I can transfer you to her phone, and if she's not able to answer, you can leave a message and she will call you back. Would that be okay? You really want to speak with her. Okay, 
No, that's fine. Hold on just a minute and I'll transfer you. Uh-huh. 